Hey, it's your girl Isha here, founder of the Carnivalista Lifestyle. And here's what I know about you. You don't love yourself. It hurts me to say that. It also is probably hard for you to hear that. But here's how I know this. I know this because as a woman myself, definitely in my 20s and my 30s, and I still struggle with it in my 40s, there are situations that you are in right now. There are circumstances that you are allowing in your life that are not showing yourself that you love you. The job that you're working that you hate or that you are constantly exhausted by or you have a boss that demeans you or disrespects you and you keep putting up with that, you keep allowing that, it's because you don't really love yourself. Because if you loved yourself, you would find another job, you would find another situation that would pay you what you're worth, that you wouldn't have to put up with that. Perhaps you're in a relationship, romantic or otherwise. This could be a friend, a family member. You are in a relationship that does not value you. This person is emotionally abusing you, verbally abusing you, perhaps even physical abuse is involved. However, you allow that relationship to stay in your life. If you really loved yourself, you would not do that to yourself. Now, let me take a step back. I feel that I can say this to you because I was in this place myself. <laughs> and I, la I can laugh now, but in my 20s and my 30s, this was a deep source of pain and sadness for me because of relationships that were not healthy because of jobs that robbed me of my sanity, robbed me of my talent, or I, let me take a step back, that I allowed to rob my sanity, I allowed to steal my talent, and they were not good for me. And I stayed because I really did not love myself. Because when you have a profound and deep sense of knowing and loving yourself and knowing that you love yourself, there is so much stuff that you would not put up with in your life, okay? And that is real. You would not be in that job where your boss has called you a derogatory name for the millionth time. You would not be in that relationship that drains your energy, drains your talent, and does not value you. There's all of these things that you would not do. You would not do if you really, really, really deeply loved yourself. And I want you to know there is hope. It is possible for you to love yourself and make good money and be in a relationship that values you as much as you value yourself. It is absolutely possible. It is there for you. It does take some work on your part a, to disentangle all of these situations that don't love you back. <laughs> it does take some deep inner reflection. It does take some travel, which I am so excited about because travel was one of the ways that I discovered love for myself. And the Carnivalista lifestyle is all about sharing that knowledge with you and supporting you through your self-love journey through travel. So I hope you'll stick around. Definitely sign up for our mailing list. That's just below. And make sure that we keep in touch with you so we can bring you more support, more hope, more love, more joy to your inbox. And let's connect, okay? Remember, you deserve love, happiness, and carnival. We'll be in touch soon.